blood. Up to five liters of this invaluable liquid is pumped continuously through your body. Blood has a vital job. It delivers oxygen to our organs and tissues through red blood cells. At UF Health, we care about each and every drop of our patient's blood. Because of this, we have launched a program called Patient Blood Management, also known as PBM. PBM involves all disciplines and uses a variety of actions to maintain and preserve a patient's own blood. Through this program, we have implemented the most advanced methods to keep blood loss during surgery to a minimum. However, there are situations when we may need to transfuse blood. We use almost 50,000 units of blood in transfusions each year. Although we are proud to meet the highest safety standards for our blood supply, we know that each transfusion comes with a minimal risk for our patients, which can be severe in a very small number of cases. To minimize the need for transfusions, we monitor daily our blood utilization carefully. We are constantly updating our transfusion guidelines based on international recommendations. Our bodies need iron to build red blood cells. Under normal conditions, iron is absorbed from our food, but when the iron stores in our body become low, we are unable to keep our red blood cell levels high enough to play their vital role in oxygen supply. This is known as anemia. Symptoms of anemia can be fatigue, pale skin, shortness of breath, or dizziness. But sometimes, you don't have any symptoms at all. Almost 4.2 billion people worldwide have anemia, mostly from iron deficiency. When anemia is present before surgery, the likelihood for a transfusion increases. Luckily, iron deficiency can be easily diagnosed and treated. Treating anemia before surgery has been shown to reduce the need for a blood transfusion. The Patient Blood Management Program teaches physicians and patients the benefits of screening for anemia before surgery. It improves the options to minimize blood loss during surgery and it overall improves the safety of our patients. Before surgery, ask your doctor about the patient blood management program and screening for anemia.